Alright, hi there, mateys, my name is Darky Rain, and welcome back to Before They Leave. So, I hope that my save file saved, and it did, awesome, so... This is where we left off, so we were given an option, I forgot what we were asked, and then we responded, and then that's where I ended it, so... We're gonna continue this story and see where it goes, it's actually kinda interesting, you know, again, I've never played a, a, a what's it called, a visual novel game before until this one you know last episode but that's the first this is the first uh, visual novel that i've ever played because honestly i'm more into watching him rather than playing him but hey i'm actually kind of liking this i like where this is going it's kind of like reading a book and honestly i i don't like reading books okay i don't like reading books i learn all my stuff from other sources <laughs> but anyways so let's continue and I believe I can press enter, okay. It's a clear, but she's uh, getting to do just her own. I can't remember if this is, hang on. Back, Sam, try, okay, so yeah, okay, th this is it. This is where we chose, so we chose to notice Katie. Try to, yeah, we chose to notice Katie, so Sam is a little surprised gesture that glances Katie, who's talking with the others. Katie must have felt that Sam needed some emotional support in that moment, or Katie just wants to hold on to Sam. Okay, so yeah, she's holding to our hands and all that, so let's continue. It's unclear, but she... Ugh. She lets Katie continue to do so, allow adjusting her own hand to hold Katie's. Sam had begun leaving with Katie living... Oh, okay, so they're kind of like roommates. Oh, uh, excuse me. Oh, I'm so burpy today. I'm sorry. Since she was 14 or so. Oh, wow. Her mother took, an, took, took on a new job that required her to be abroad. At first, she'd come back and stay for weeks at a time. But eventually, she just stopped coming back, and Sam stopped bothering her. Kay, Katie and her family remained Sam's only emotional support. And at times, this meant she felt like a burden. Katie and her parents ruled violently disagree with such a claim, but it's how Sam would feel sometimes. They're Sam's godparents, and she herself had grown up with Katie her entire life. Sam's parents never had older kids, but Sam never felt like she needed more than Katie and her siblings anyway. As far as Sam's concerned, Katie's her sister. Daw, cling. <laughs> She's doing the pirate thing. Cling. Sam feels some comfort with this, some of her anxiety and tension relieved. Good! So Katie knows that Sam can feel exhausted when she's out like this. What does Sam do? I look around. I'm, I don't think it's time to go, you know, home yet. Holly keeps glancing at Sam. Sam catches her eye. Up, up, up. What, 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 what? Oh, you're looking at me weird. What's going on? Holly softly maintains eye contact. Contact. Sam stares back, but it's surprised by Holly's expression. A look of longing? No, that's not right, concern. No, Sam had seen plenty of that. Okay, at this point she's just... She's just going like that, so I, yeah, you can't tell what expression she's doing. Ooh, one micro expression morphing into another, a sixth of a smile shifting into a tenth of sorrow, a twentieth of how are you doing math with this, yo? Uh, <laughs> fear fitting into a fifth of hope, constantly changing until Sam finally breaks eye content contact. Yeah, what was that? That was more than a random stare goof, was it though? Hey, <laughs> Katie declares she would be the one of the last remaining true humans, but with a surprise plot twist of being the prince of a bird kingdom who'd been kidnapped as an infant and kept in a glamour all their all their, all their life. I'm like, uh, well, what's what's his uh, name? Jimmy from South Park. Hey, hey, g g g g g guys. <laughs> Except that I don't stutter, I just, I do the sounds on purpose. <laughs> Sam puts the thought out of her mind. Awkward, awkward staring doesn't actually mean anything. But he kind of does, you know, if somebody's looking at you like... What does that mean? <laughs> Holly stands up and excuses herself to go to the bathroom. <clears throat> a sense of exhaustion overwhelms Sam. It being a long day, and it was time to go home. She's a strong introvert. Stick it, stick it out, leave. Stick it out, we gotta do this. If it was me, I would. Again, I've never felt like what she's feeling, but still. 
It's, this is just if it was me. Sam decides she would stick it out and wait for Holly to come back for le before leaving. Another half hour passes. Finally, it's time to wrap things up and the group shuffles around to the, the, the table and chairs. Sam finishes up first and waits outside for the others. Sam thinks to herself about Holly's eye content. Was she just being silly? Sam's unsure, but doesn't feel motivated to try and investigate more. See, when stuff like that happens, what I personally would do is ask that person, you know, ask him just directly. Hey, so what was that? What, what, what's going on? Is something wrong? You know, I would ask him. I wouldn't just keep on wandering. I mean, you don't lose anything by asking. Ooh, what's going on? Okay, everybody left, I guess. So you don't lose anything by asking the person. Just, just ask him, okay? Ask him in a nice way. Katie comes out first, followed by the others. They walk down the block and slowly part ways until it's just Sam and Katie. She didn't even talk to me. Hmm, she just left. Bye, Holly. <laughs> Finally, Katie and Sam come home, and Sam goes and falls into her bed. She naps for an unknown amount of time until Katie wakes her up, walking, in, walking into their bathroom with glasses of water. Hey, Sam. That's sleepy, huh? Katie rests one of the cups on the night counter. Mm-hmm. Sam mumbles in reply, half awake. Okay, sleepyhead. Want me to turn off the light? Mmm. <laughs> okay, good night. Kitty switches off the lights as she leaves the room, closing the door. A good long day ending. Long day? I, they pretty much just spend the whole day on a cafe. <laughs> okay, thank you for playing before... What? Okay, that's it? No, that isn't even long enough. Oh my god, okay. Ah, again, I hate it when they leave you on a cliffhanger. God damn it, I should have made the last episode only like like 20 minutes long, so this one could have been a little longer. Well, <laughs> there are several endings. Wait, what? There oh, so depending on what I answer, what I say, I guess there are different endings. Maybe if I wouldn't waited for Holly, maybe she would have called me or something. I don't know. There are several endings. Which one did you get? Did Sam confess? Uh, I can't remember, did she? I think she did. Did Holly Lee, did Holly have a moment with Sam in the restroom? Whoa. Whoa, no. No, that didn't happen. <laughs> did nothing happen or worse? I don't know. I don't know. I don't think she conf I don't know if she confessed or not. Confess what? Uh, did she have a moment in the restroom with Sam? No, that didn't happen. Did nothing happen? Well, I guess something happened, it just left me wondering what Holly was up to, or worse. Well, no, nah, it, it, it wasn't worse. If you like Sam and her story, you can follow what happens in her life after high school, and becoming a time trap- What the fuck? That escalated quickly! <laughs> a time traveler! In my webcomic, Time f Fiddler. You have a webcomic? Oh, cool. Art writing and programming by Ellis Kim. Thank you, Ellis Kim. I like the story. I wish you could continue it though. Not not like not only like in your comic, but actually in this game. You know, continue this game. Music by the talented Lillian G. Pretty relaxing music, Mr. Mr. or Mrs. G. I don't know if you're a he or she. So links available in the about screen. Thanks for playing. Thanks for the game. Oh man! I hate cliffhangers, but that's what you get with these games, because they're, they're demos. They're usually demos or like they're early access, so you don't get to play the, the full game. And you know what's what's sad about it is that mo most of these games, they don't make it to full release. So you never get to see the full story. Most of the time, okay? I don't know if this one will. I hope it does. So if the developer is watching this... I hope you that, that you actually finish the game, okay? Because I really want to see where the story goes. I, I, I can't just stay like that. That was, that was such a short game. It was like, what? Uh, maybe a little bit less than an hour? So I really want to see where it goes. As I do with most of the games that I finish and they leave me in a cliffhanger. <laughs> so anyways, guys. So that was before they leave. I hope you liked it. So... Before we go, as usual, thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, if you liked it, smack the like button on the booty like a true pirate, subscribe and become legend. That being said, thank you for watching once again and I'll see you guys in the next game. Adios, lads!